Hello, Jabber here. Welcome back to another episode of the Modded Minecraft Survival. And today, we are going to do something exciting. But before I do that, as you can see, I have done myself a nice upgrade. Now, I've did this all between episodes from the last one, which I totally sucked on the battle tower. But, here we are. And as you can see, there's a lot of stuff that has changed. The first thing you guys can probably notice is my heart. I have more hearts. I actually have, what, like six more? I, uh, so, I was actually doing the battle tower, and uh, I didn't beat it yet, but <clears throat> there's all, all those mobs out there that uh, gave me a really good amount of loot, and I did get to the top, again, didn't beat it because the, the golem is still alive, he actually blew himself off the top, and he's in the first floor now, uh, so very much avoided, and uh, I got some six diamonds, I still can't use them because again, my level isn't high enough to get to all that. I need, I think uh, for diamond pickaxe, I need 16 mining. So, and then same thing for attacks. I, I, I can't even use it now, which kind of sucks, but um, that's, that's how it is, and that's how it shall be. And then I also win some more mining. I got 40 iron ingots, and I got copper ingots. Now, also, and then I mean a lot of stuff has happened. So, here's some really cool stuff that I found. So, I found some more recall potions and some wormhole potions. Then I found all these right here, which I don't know what they are, but this says scroll of identification. And uh, I was actually looking into the mod itself. We'll talk about that later. I got all these right here. These are all loot drops. Um, so this is really cool. And I found this really cool. Uh, where is it at? Oh, loot sword. But it's level 16, and as you can see, I'm level 13. So I still can't use it. I found another fire. Was it? No, I think I found a spark bomb. There you go. I found all of these, which I am going to actually make a bow, which is why I have this here. Uh, so I'll be making a bow today. And I have found all this really cool armor, and that's why I have. Ooh, and I also found some really cool wolf armor, which is going to be really cool. And since I have a lot of drops from from like mobs, which I'm going to be showing you really soon. Uh, here are my mob drops right here. A bunch of bones, a bunch of strings, because that was everything in that tower was skeletons and spiders. And here's a really cool thing that the spiders drop is a wild bezoar. And I can't get poisoned anymore. So that's pretty cool. Uh, also, uh, plus two attacks on speed. That's actually pretty cool. Uh, but yeah, uh, some other things I did want to work on right now. Where is it? Where is it at? Because I wanted to work on a few things. Alright, they're right here. Duh. Okay. <clears throat> so, I got apples. I got golden ingots. I actually want to make a book that's very specific to this. Um, let me see. Book. I wanted to... Let me search it up real quick. So, the quest book I can make. I wanted to make that right there. And then the other... Oh, no, please move. Please, please move. Was it this that I wanted to make? No, I didn't. Uh, where is the other book? Because there's another book I wanted to make that I was very interested in. Where's that? The Book of Absorption. So this right here. So here's what it does. <clears throat> when used, 2 plus max absorption. So it costs 5 levels. You can't use this. Because um, I have 2 levels. But I do want to make it and I need golden apples for it. And I have ingots right here which is really good. But, uh, I'm going to have to actually do it here. So let me see how many of these I can make. I can make two. So I need how many more? Two more. So if I can get two more, and I actually need a book of quill instead of a book. So I do have an ink sack and a feather right here. Because again, the drops were really big. Oh, the feather I found in the loot chest in the tower. They had some really useless ones. But, I mean, I guess the feather... Came in handy at the end of the day. Uh, I'll make one of these. And I'm going to need two more. So that means I need... I, I, I'm not even going to calculate that right now. But hey, I have a quest book right here. I'm actually going to put this right here. Because I I'm, I know what I'm going to be making. and Or at least I know what I'm going to want to be making. Okay, so the quest book opens this up. So theme. I don't, I don't know if these overworlds are like theme. You see, I'm, I'm not going to mess with this here. <laughs> So I'm just going to put this on the side for now. I'm actually going to put it here in the book area. But today I really wanted to focus on this right here, the spell books. And 
I found a zombie spawner and a spider spawner, which, oh, well, no, you already know about the zombie spawner. But I found a spider spawner, which is right next to the zombie spawner, which is really cool. It's just, like, a little bit lower. And I did connect the tunnel down together, but uh, before I go down there, I do want to work on this. So, uh, I do need a wand to do these. So, let me see, a magic wand uh, current. So, yeah, uh, duh, duh, duh. I need a magical crystal, which I need this. So, thankfully, I have one. No, where is it? One of these crystals. Okay, so we put in there, right? And I have a magic wand. Okay, I need a golden nugget, or, or is it a golden nugget? Or can I use anything? I have some right here, actually. Instead of using those, um, let's make one of these. Look at that. I think I can make some more iron, uh, some more gold ingots. Oh, whoa. Gold ingots. There you go. <laughs> I made one. What the heck? Okay, so one is fine. That, that's good for now. Let's put this back in there. I did die, so I gotta take that out. There it is, the magic wand current level is still unknown. Uh, I do need a table. I forgot what it was. A what kind of table was it? Arcane workbench. I need a lapis lazuli, purple carpet, some gold ingots, some more mystical crystals. Oh my god. Uh, mystical crystals and some stone, which I don't have. Or I could find the wizard uh, tower, and the wizard will have it there. But I have to do that. Uh, so let's. Is it nighttime already? Okay, it is okay. <clears throat> so I only have one scroll of identification and I have to choose from one of these and go with this one. And I can't see what it is, element uh, mana. It's a novice so I could use it once I upgrade it and I'm gonna It's uh, ignite. <clears throat> Set the target on fire for ten seconds also works like a flint and steel. Oh nice, that's pretty cool. So that is something I have in my arsenal. I can't use it, of course. I cannot. No, I can't use it. Uh, <clears throat> but I will keep it here. All right. So back to what I wanted to do after the spell book, which is going to do, which is going to be a mob grinder. I want to do the zombie one because I don't know how to do a spider one yet. I think that was going to be a little bit more difficult, more complicated. <clears throat> this is going to be my first mob farm. I don't think I'll be doing a tutorial on it. You'll just, you guys will just see me doing it. Um, but I do need to craft some hoppers, so I'm going to craft a hopper. I think I'm going to do two of them. Uh, no, actually, no. I'm actually going to craft only one. And then I'm actually going to need a chest, and I do have a bunch of chests here because I did collect them from the tower. So I have an, a nice amount of them. Uh, about the bow. Let me actually make the bow that I wanted to make. Uh, let's go here to bows. If I can write correctly, uh, and we're gonna do the iron one because I want to use those right there. This would be pretty cool. The diamond one seems interesting. Um, shift to details. Uh, long ray takes longer to draw. Long ray version of the standard bow. Uh, okay, so I, I hope this uh, is gonna be useful. Um, I think first thing that I want to use the diamonds for is the pickaxe, and then the rest is like that. So I'll keep that one out of the way. And just use these for the things that I wanted to use them for. So I'll have the diamond pickaxe made right now. I will not be able to use it, of course, like I said. And I mentioned level 14, goodness gracious. <clears throat> and I hope that this... Right, oh wait, I need the... <laughs> I need string. And I, again, like I said, I have a bunch of string, which is going to be good for me. And I hope that this right here... Ooh, what is this? Oh, no, man. Well, I can't use that. Uh, where's it at? Uh, uh, diamond, 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 diamond. I saw it. There it is. Okay, so I can make this, and let's hope it's in a good level. Level 12, I can use it, which is cool. Uh, and now I have a bunch of arrows that I could use. Oh, you know what? Can I try making the anvil now? Because I know I wanted to make that last episode, but I did not have enough. Um, so that's one. I think I can make it now. I'm not sure. 
Yes, I can actually. Let's make that anvil work. There we go. Now we have an anvil, which is going to be even even better for me. Let's put it right there. <clears throat> now I can take all these broken stuff and actually combine it with my stuff that I have here, which is going to be really cool. Very, very cool. So let me get the bow. It doesn't belong there. These bows, I can actually combine now. It's going to be good. I can repair the broken ones, so... It's gonna cost a lot though. Oh man, I cannot, I cannot do that actually. I'm gonna have to do that when I actually need them. Uh, in this case, I only have this one right here, so I should be fine with that one. Uh, let me take a whole stack of these, and I'm just gonna leave them there. Just, ooh, nice, nice. Okay, cool. So I'll have that there, the hopper, and then the copper. Again, I'm just gonna leave them here. I'm not gonna be eating most of this stuff. Uh, except I'm gonna have to leave that there, and I'm gonna take the iron pickaxe. I think it's a little okay. Should I should be able to use it, of course. <clears throat> so I'll have that with me. I have my weapon with me. Right, I need a bucket of water. Actually, I need two. So let me make another. Ooh, I have just enough to make another bucket of water. Right there, for an infinite source of water. <clears throat> Gotta make sure to fill those up before I leave because I don't want to forget about that. Let's do that. Ooh, winter is coming. Look at that. The the cold is already here. The the water. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What the heck? They're building some interesting stuff over here. Like what the heck? Huh? Okay. Anyways, I hope they don't. Tear down my stuff because uh, that would be kind of that would kind of suck. <clears throat> but anyways, let's uh, let us continue on with our adventure here. And got this, and I am gonna need a lot of cobblestone. Um, and again, I did a lot of mining, so I do have a lot. And actually, I did use a lot as well to uh, to mine. So to do the stairs, I did a bunch of stairs. Uh, so let's go down there and start making our mob spawner. Okay, here we are. So, as you know, it was on the right, but I did cover this up because I didn't want to get the magma monsters in the way. Down here is the spider spawner right here, pretty close to us, not too far away. Um, did I get this? I did. So like I said, I, we'll work on the spider one a different day, and this one we'll work on right now. Uh, I have to make sure everything is lit up because I didn't bring any torches. Of course I didn't. Um, I'll be right back. Alright guys, so I am now back and here we are again. So we're going to have to start clearing out the room. And then we're going to have to start building uh, the room up. And then yeah, I'll see you guys once I have done that. And then I'll explain what I did. Alright, so here's what it looks like now. So what I did, I basically just dug down three. And from here to every side around it, I dug four blocks. I kept the same blocks here. Uh, that way we can have the maximum spawn rate. I can't even, okay. Now we're going to make a room where it's actually going to happen. So we're going to go this way. We're just going to go this far uh, I'll see because I I think there's a specific amount of limit to where it doesn't spawn anymore I'm gonna have to look that up by the way my iron big axe already broke and before it broke I actually collected these right here the heart crystal shots I thought it was ruby um, back then but uh looks like uh, I'm gonna see what the the most I can be away from it Okay, so it looks like it's a good distance. I can work with this right here. So, I'm going to put this right here. Yeah, I'm going to make sure I can go at least 
three blocks more. Okay. Uh, yeah. Uh, let's try four. Oh, four doesn't work for us. Okay, so that's the limit. This is the limit to where it can spawn. So I'm going to make a room right here. And uh, I'll be right back with you guys. Okay, so I came back to make some more tools because I ran out of the uh, actual pickaxes. So I came back and now I can make some more beautiful tools. Now, I also made some fences because that's actually one of the components that I actually forgot to uh, actually acquire. Well, not acquire, but like make because I completely forgot about it. And uh, yeah, so we have fences. We have a lot of stuff and I need to deposit some of this stuff. Uh, we got some of the hard crystals. I think I already told you guys. Uh, but let's uh, move on. So I got everything here that I need. Uh, too much cobblestone. I have too much right now. Um, I, don't, I don't think I need that much. I'm going to put this stuff in there. I made these cobble sl slabs because I need to put that on top of the, um, the spawner. And then we're going to move on from there. So... Let's see, so we got some of these, we got a bunch of signs, which is good. Why is these three glitched out? Anyways, we'll use these first. Um, then we have this, organizing my stuff because like it's everywhere right now. Got my food, and I'm just waiting on this to end, but I think I'll just leave it there and we'll go right back to doing what we we're trying to do. But as you can see, winter is here guys. Winter is finally here. You should have seen the snow, it was very really nice. Here we go guys, it is complete, there's a lot of noise, a lot, oh god that is loud for me, I'm not gonna lie, there we go, now all I need to do is kill them all, this should increase my level up very quickly, the only problem is the level of some of these are gonna be very high, and I might spawn in, oh look at that, some more hearts, yes. So, also, I might spawn in some really strong ones, the ones that have like webbing and stuff like that. Those are gonna be really hard to achieve to defeat. Uh, and just in case I miss any, I guess that hopper doesn't work, huh? Should have probably thought about that. Um, maybe if I put a half slab there, and then. Oh. But hey, it's working so far. I'm getting the experience I want. Oh, they can still attack me though. So, it gives me half a heart, but it does take some experience away, which is really good because I have this farm. So now that made it work for me. That I'm very excited that it's actually working. Now I have a plan. Why is the oh, iron? Does that mean I could possibly form iron? That's going to be very good. So, not only am I going to be able to form experience and levels, which is going to be very, but I mean very helpful, I'm also going to be able to try out some more mob farm ideas. This is just too loud. So, battle towers. They have a bunch of spawners there. And I was planning to use the same technique with this on the spawner as well. Only problem is... Those mob towers are really strong. Let me take these. Hopefully they'll kill me. There you go. And the only problem is, oh my god, this is taking a lot of, uh, a lot of my weapon stuff. So, if I can get mending on something, that would be really great. But it looks like this is working out pretty well so far. I haven't encountered anything. And I think AFK, well not AFK, but like, off, off, you know, between episodes I'll be doing this because it's going to be very helpful to do this. Oh my lord, this is really cool. This is working out really well. Okay, I made it home safely and I went to sleep so time passed by and look how beautiful that snow looked. Did you guys see it? I don't know if you guys missed it but that was really beautiful. Now I did gain some more levels which is really cool so I'm actually going to go straight into this and I'm gonna go into combat because I saw this iron skin here uh, it reduces damage taken it's gonna be really good so I'm gonna I'm gonna be doing that a lot so I'm gonna be doing iron skin and then you have the shield block which is gonna be great because I am gonna be using mostly shield blocking attacks and stuff like that 
Then we're gonna move on to this. I can. I only have five. I did make everything five except this, so I can make another one. Um, do I? Do I really need that? Um, I guess I'll put it on there because I don't know what the building is for, but uh, at the moment. But I think we'll do good for now. Now we did get another spell book, which is really cool. Uh, that is one way I got this uh, in there. So let me see. Okay, so that's a completely new one. Um, but I did get these books right here from uh, the mobs that I killed in the in the tower. So I have protection on this, which is really cool. And I have a oh wait protection. Wait a minute, I can actually put this into the thing. Protection 2, Protection 1, and no it doesn't, okay. <laughs> it still doesn't do Protection 2, which is kind of sucks, but... Okay, so it doesn't transfer over the thing. I wonder if it does to a book, maybe? Can I do a book? I'm not sure if I can do a book. I'm gonna need more sugar cane, but I don't wanna use up my sugar cane because I need to grow some more. My crop has grown, which is really good, so let me grow it right now. Well, when I grow it, but I can't grow any crop now, so I think I'm gonna have to wait till winter is over because I can't grow a crop with ice, so you know. Unfortunately, we're gonna have to wait on that, and yeah, so guys, thank you guys for watching today's episode. It was really cool. Um, I finally made something that is going to help us in the series and I am really debating to just stay in this area which is really cool but I do want to explore out and I really do want to find a different biome besides the birch forest that we're in right now but I need to level up first because it's, it's a dangerous world out there and we all need to level up so uh, I'll see you guys next time thank you guys for watching if you guys want to see how I built the mob spawner in this mod pack in general just let me not know down in the comments below and then i can make like a separate video in a separate world uh and i'll make it in creative mode for you guys and i can explain it uh more in depth uh so yeah i'll see you guys next time make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you already have it and uh, we'll see you guys next time see ya